Hi, Dave Jack here, Superintendent of Fauquier County Public Schools with another edition of Three Great Things. And I'm blending uh, two weeks. I'm blending uh, the latter part of last week and then this week. Uh, but I, I have seen some great things lately. And I want to start with uh, Pearson Elementary School. So I was at Pearson last Friday. And um, I guess once a month they do a, a thing called an above and beyond assembly. And I was... Um, thoroughly, thoroughly impressed by several things. One, the principal, the new principal there, Mark Marchinetti, was just amazing. Uh, he's a former military uh, military guy, and boy, he had those kids uh, just, it was just very impressive. Organized, he was running around, leading cheers, um, pumping the kids up, and um, I, I wish I had half his energy, but I was just thoroughly impressed by the above and beyond uh, assembly. And then it included uh, the recognition of the Pearson Teacher of the Year, uh, Andrea Martins, and a very deserving award for Andrea, but really neat experience and just really great way to end the week. Uh, earlier this week, um, I also was able to attend the Leadership Fauquier uh, program at Fauquier High School. Now, this isn't a student program. This is a, a community program whereby um, there's a cohort of future or current leaders uh, within Fauquier County who meet and, and are base, are, they're essentially learning more about the, the uh, not only the school community, but, um, you know, government, local government, a um, little bit of everything, including like uh, I presented along with Chris Coots from Lord Fairfax Community College. And um, it was really good. It was really, really interesting. We, we were able to address some really unconventional questions, and I thought that was interesting. It made me realize that these, this is a really deep thinking group of folks uh, because they asked, they asked some really interesting questions, things like, uh, you know, what is, it, what is it that keeps you up at night? How do you deal with stress? Blah, blah. Things that, kind of questions you don't typically get, but it was very interesting, and I thought it was a really worthwhile a way to spend the morning. Uh, and last but not least, um, last week I participated in um, a, a civil rights assembly at Kettle Run High School, and I'll just tell you it was an absolute honor to be invited to sit alongside people like uh, John Thompson, um, Mr. Harrison, Mr. Harrison, who used to be the principal at um, Liberty High School. In fact, I think he was may have been the first principal at Liberty High School, uh, Major Warner, uh, um, John McCarthy, uh, just some folks with some really interesting backgrounds and uh, in, many, in, in most cases had kind of lived through things like the desegregation of our schools and Jim, and Jim Crow, uh, et cetera. And I, I guess I was, I was humbled to be invited to participate in this, and I guess the kids were kind of wondering what I was doing there. Um, but it had, to, it has, I think I'm invited because it really has to do with my background, uh, growing up and, and my story, my journey as a special needs student, et cetera, et cetera. But I, I was really humbled to be there along with those folks who were sharing their stories and fielding questions from students. Um, it was very well done. David Kuzma organized it and did an outstanding job. He's a teacher at Kettle Run High School but it, it was truly exceptionally done. So thanks for that and um, hope everyone has a great weekend coming up.